here to give you a quick overview of the Gen 1 conversion tooling and resources we have on Robocorp. First up, I'd like to point out our documentation. So this is definitely the recommended place to get started. So robocorp.com slash docs slash conversion. We have playbooks, we have guides on the conversion tooling and some conversion helping. And most importantly, as always, the certificate courses are free and these are really powerful tools to get started. So definitely, definitely start from here. Then moving on to the tooling itself, we have the conversion now integrated into Automation Studio. We will be adding it to the VS Code as well, but for now it's in Automation Studio. We have support for Bluetooth, Automation Anywhere 360, and UiPath. I'll show a simple demo with Bluetooth to see this in action. So essentially, uh, the Automation Studio works as a really powerful documentation tool after the conversion. So if I go into the Flow Explorer, I can get a good overlay of what the bot is actually doing. So just from this view, I can see that, yeah, in the beginning, I see items like workbook, removing empty rows. So it's doing something Excel related in here. Then there's a for loop of inputting data because there's a submit button there. So this is kind of the first level of checking in on the bot without even looking at any PDDs or nothing like that. So this is what the bot is actually doing with the code that you, you exported. On the, on the visual editor side, you can then get a bit more detail. So you can see things like the, the arguments that are, are passed into these items and a bit more of the structure of the bot. And of course, you can start editing in here if you like to. I'll also show the code side because that's more familiar and that's kind of the highlight of the thing that we are generating just RPA uh, robot framework code and there's nothing fancy about this. And what the conversion does, it gives you the scaffolding, it gives you the structure, the order of operation that the bot does. Uh, we still have a lot of places where we, we can only add kind of comment lines. We try to bring in as much detail and help from the existing the source system as we can, but there are spots that we cannot convert and for that, I'd like, I highly welcome any feedback and any production posts that you can share with us. Please ping us on the Slack and forums so that we can make things better. Uh, the main thing to remember is that this uh, tooling is not bound to the automation studio. So what we generate is always just a robot like any other, which means that I can open it up in VS Code as well. So essentially what I get is like this. So I can just jump into VS Code and start editing the bot in here as well. So that's the quick overview. I'd like to highlight again, start from here. This is our documentation. There's a bunch of resources here. And as always, we welcome any and all feedback in our developer slacks and forums. So please be in contact with us. <laughs>